So, happy new year one and all. Uh, so I decided to start the new year by going to a classic car meet up the road. And I thought, oh, hang on, I can't go because my exhaust fell off a few months ago. I might have driven it a few miles with the exhaust just wired up with a bit of wire. So I thought, high time to do something about it. <laughs> now, as you can hear here, this is why. This is on tick over and it is pretty, pretty loud. So, uh, I had a new head torch for Christmas, so I decided to do all this in the dark. No, I started doing it in the dark because that's just when it seemed to happen. So, first job was to try and get the uh, piece of exhaust pipe off that was all smashed up. It had been trapped in the car lift. It's had a lot of uh, water in it over the years, uh, so it's all rusty. So, get the old Stilsons out and uh, gently, with a bit of oil, try and separate the two oh. parts. This took ages, <laughs> but there we go. Bingo. We've got it done. <laughs> <laughs> always do these things in the dark <laughs> with that off it's now time to make a new section so we've got a piece of exhaust pipe here and i also had a u-bend which i could cut a portion out of to the correct bend to join in with the front part of the tube. So I'm only replacing one portion of the exhaust. It is my intention to replace the exhaust with a stainless steel exhaust, but uh, this was just to get the car back in the game so I could go to the show and stop deafening the local community. So got it cut and then got it tacked in position, and then time to get it back over to the car to check that we've actually got the right angle before welding it up. So there it is on there. As you can see, the rest of the exhaust has seen better days. But this car is being recommissioned slowly. Here's the old bit. Yeah. I seem I to lose the uh, plot a bit here. I think lying in the Seen rain does that. Days. That's going all aboard the Scrap Heap Express. So with that done, we uh, started her up. And as we can see, fumes coming out the back of the car. That's where they're supposed to be. So uh, give it a bit of a run. Uh, now, with the exhaust not blowing so much, you can actually get to tap it, which clearly needs adjusting. But yeah, much quieter, much quieter. Uh -huh. Traffic eight around, that means one thing, turning left. Uh, so here we are, this is the uh, Great British Car Journey Amagate, highly recommend it. Uh, this is a car meet on the 2nd of January. Where are we? We are at the Great British Car Journey, Ambergate. <laughs> so here we are, parked up where we're asked to park. Some people have washed and polished their cars. I don't appear to have bothered. Uh, lots of nice cars here. One of my favourites was this uh, Riley. Uh, really nice. My grandfather used to have one of those. And then this uh, Second World War uh, motorcade, shall we say, with this beautiful ambulance, which has got a canvas body. Quite a diverse range of cars, new cars, old cars. Just nice to meet a load of enthusiasts and have a chinwag and a bacon sandwich. So as we can see, much quieter. <laughs> <laughs> 